Yo, what's good, man? It's your boy DT3, man. I'm back at you with another video, man. New media notification gang. God squad. It's what it is, man. Today is the big day. It's fight night. Wilder, Ortiz. Who you got? I got Ortiz. But that's not what this video is about. This video is about you racist-ass people in the boxing world who got something against black fighters. This bitch right here, Abel Sanchez, said out his own mouth that black fighter style is not entertaining. People do not want to see the sweet science of boxing. They want to see somebody get hurt. And I didn't want to make a video complaining about it. I wanted to make a video so y'all could hear the words come out of Abel Sanchez's mouth himself. And y'all won't think I'm just hating on this nigga because he's Triple G's trainer. Because a lot of y'all Triple G fans will be on this man's nuts as soon as I make a video talking about this man. Look at this shit. I mean it that uh, 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 our black fighters fight in a style that is not pleasing to the fans, let's just say, and that's why they don't sell. Uh, some of the black fighters, I had a kid, young man named Terry Norris, who I molded in a Mexican style. He was an attacker, he was a killer, he's going to come and hurt you. Unfortunately, some of the fighters now is more of the sweet science. Fans don't want to see, see the sweet science, no matter what they say. Fans want to see somebody get hurt. And... Um, when I said that he was like Mayweather, he fought in a very defensive style like Mayweather. But watch Mayweather when he was a 35-pounder and a 30-pounder. He was a killer then. No, he fought to knock you out. He fought to hurt you. So Canelo, what did I say the other day? Uh, Mayweather. Uh, Pause. Let me tell y'all something. You know how they say in order to get to the money Mayweather phase, you got to go through the pretty boy Floyd phase. Now, when he said Floyd was a killer when he was a 35-pounder, Floyd wasn't no killer. Floyd just threw more punches because I think from about f the beginning of his career to probably like fight 20, Floyd was more of a defensive fighter. You know, he fought more defensively because he was trained by his dad and his dad, you know what I'm saying, basically, you know, put a lot of emphasis on defense with Floyd when he first became pro. So he was real defensive his first about 15, 20 fights. Now, when he got with Roger, when he started training with Roger, he became more offensive. He started taking more uh, more punishment. You know what I mean? So, he wasn't that he was a killer. He just threw more punches. You know what I'm saying? That's all that was. Excuse me, my battery dying, y'all. But he just took more. He just threw more punches. He wasn't no killer. You know what I'm saying? He didn't really. He wasn't like he was just going in there putting people to sleep. Like Floyd wasn't that dude. He was just more. He just fought the harder fights. You know what I'm saying? That's all it was for Floyd. So... For him to say that Floyd was a killer then, he lying. He just saying that shit to make himself look good. And he also saying that shit about black fighters because he don't want Triple G to fight the Charlo, one of the Charlo brothers. Because he afraid that Triple G going to get his ass beat by the Charlos. So, Abel, right now for that shit you just said, you a bitch. And I speak for the whole box community, you a bitch. The whole black box community, you a bitch. Matter of fact, I speak for boxing as a sport as a whole. That's a bitch move. You would never tell somebody, oh, the people don't want to see the sweet science. They just want to see people get hurt. Well, if they just want to see motherfuckers get hurt, why don't y'all just watch MMA? There's no sweet science about that. That's just two people who practice all types of martial arts come together to just beat the hell out of each other. But if you want to see the sweet science, we hit to not get hit, that's boxing. All right, you ain't for to come revolutionize the game. People just want to see people get knocked out. Yeah, but I want to live to live to fight another day. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to the boxing voice. You see, you see what it is, man. Notification gang, man, all day. But um, <clears throat> fuck Abel Sanchez. Fuck what he talking about. He just hating. You know what I'm saying? He just mad because we got the swag. We get shit done and we dominate every sport that we in. Whether if it's you feel me? Boxing, football, basketball, baseball, shit, hockey. We in hockey now, too. Smashing in that shit. Soccer. You know what I'm saying? African-American athletes, we dominate. It's what we do, man. It ain't my fault your old ass couldn't do shit in your prime, you bitch. Fuck Abel Sanchez. Conor McGregor turned Mayweather into a Mexican fighter, and uh, Golovkin turned Canelo into a Mayweather. You know, uh, I, don't, I don't believe that he can do that again and allow himself to be ridiculed by the fans in his own home country. Did this, did this wetback just say, yeah, I called him a wetback. Fuck Abel Sanchez. Did this motherfucking wetback got all these dents and holes in his face just say that um, Conor McGregor made Mayweather fight 
become a killer, fight a Mexican style? Correct me if I'm wrong. Mayweather fought that type of fight because he couldn't. He knew that Conor McGregor had plans for the shoulder roll. He had plans for the Philly Shell defense. So he knew he couldn't fight that type of fight. So he knew the best way to fight him was to just basically keep his head in his chest and give him basically some type of pressure. He wasn't like dogging him, running through punches, and it wasn't no like wing and ding type of fight. It wasn't that type of fight. Abel Sanchez sounds stupid as fuck. You know what I'm saying? And Canelo didn't fight no Mayweather style fight. He wasn't using the shoulder roll all like that. He was using good ring generalship, very good ass head movement, and that's how he made Gennady Golovkin look like a goddamn fool punching that fucking air. You just mad because Canelo had your dude looking like a goddamn fool. Get the fuck out of here, man. And yeah, I had Canelo winning 117, 116. I had him winning by one point because he took that last round. That's why I gave Canelo the fight. So, fuck Abel Sanchez. This dude don't know what the fuck he talking about. He just a hater on black fighters. I wouldn't be surprised if Floyd Mayweather Sr. came up in this dude's face and punched him in his shit. Because he ain't going to say that shit to Floyd Mayweather Sr. Floyd Mayweather Sr. ain't no joke. You know what I'm saying? That's the dude that says, you think you can hit me? Ba -ba bam Over. I hope Floyd Mayweather Sr. see this dude. Punch this man in his face. Because I'm too young to put my hands on Abel Sanchez. And I think Abel Sanchez needs his ass whooped. So I say, Floyd Mayweather Sr., Roger Mayweather, whoop this nigga ass, man. Shit, I hope Freddie Ropes put a, put a fucking foot in your ass, man. For real. Give you a Parkinson's ass whooping. Straight up. But, um... That's all for now, man. You already know what it is, man. It's your boy, DT3, man. New media, notification game, guy squad. It's what it is, man. It's fight night. You know what I'm saying? Wilder, Ortiz. It's going down. Showtime tonight. Follow your boy on Instagram at dboywso. Follow your boy on Twitter at dboywso. Going to be live tonight on Instagram watching the fight. You know what I'm saying? So, man, if you follow me on, on Instagram, I'm going to be live on that thing, watching the Wilder Ortiz fight with my boy, Tenry the Great. Follow my boy on Instagram at Tenry84, man. You already know what it is, man. It's your boy, DT3, New Media, Notification Gang, God Squad. It's what it is, man. Let's let's just get this shit popping, man. Fuck Abel Sanchez. Fuck these haters, man. Let's get it, man. Shout out to all black fighters, man. Wakanda forever, man. One.